I think when you, I think it's the numbers, 20 out of 22 stars. When you essentially have everybody coming back, I think there may be like one or two kids who may play like off the demons. When everyone's coming back, you expect your expectations to go, you know, obviously uh, um, a lot higher. Um, you know, last year, I think I said that last year was all about breaking streaks. You know, whatever the streak was, whether it was winning a game and then also, you know, breaking the section, the section streak of six years. I um, mean, that really focused on our kids. You know, no matter what we preached or what we talked about, that was always lying on their back. And I think, um, you know, breaking those two things has allowed us in the off season for our kids to kind of focus on other goals. Like, you know, obviously, I think we're fortunate to have so many kids back. I think it's rare for any team to have that. And obviously, you know, with you know, the, you know the, uh, the other teams in the league, you know, obviously they've, they've lost a couple of things. You know, go, you know, losing hockey, LS moving up. Catholic is always Catholic. They're going to return, and I mean, and they're going to reload. Um, you know, I think it's just. It's just us stepping up to their level. Well, you know, offensively, you know, obviously we've we've taken strides. I think each year, you know, obviously our returning quarterback, our two uh, um, all league wideouts, you know, having uh, running uh, stable running backs, our, our whole line returns. Um, you know, and obviously that that's a huge thing because we would like to, you know, focus on, on running the ball a little bit more. Um, and I think the thing we talked about earlier is that this off season has been the focus on number one's defense. You know, we have got to get better defensively. It's a, you know we have the athletes' offense. Everyone talks about well, you should have your offense. Well, you know what? Those kids are. Those kids are athletes. Like they've worked hard, they're strong. They need to play defense too, and that's a whole new mentality that we really, really focus on and had to create. Um, you know, we hired we hired we hired a, a new D coordinator, uh, Dino DiPaolo. Um, you know, formerly from Lancaster Catholic and CV and a bunch of other schools, a couple styles. So we're very fortunate to have him just to create that kind of mentality. Um, you know, obviously him, you know, just bringing that type of winning a winning mentality, um, and just the passion for defense. I think has really helped with our kids. Um, you know, we just we 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 expect our kids to. Uh, you know, obviously, I think you know uh, competing in section three. You know, I, I think to be really competitive, not just win, you know, win like one section three game, but you know, hopefully get uh, hopefully get in the mix. You know, because I mean, for the for the past couple of years, you know, honestly, PV's been a W. Like teams looking their schedule, you know, you know, we're, we're you know, well, well we're going to beat PV. So you know, and and, and we're working to change that.